Oh! Six, 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 ill. Yeah. You might notice the music is not the Buckethead version, because I've heard some of that. Um, and I'm not, not big into it. So I'm going with the MIDI version, because I like Jimmy's music anyway. I think it's Jimmy anyway, isn't it? Anyway, yeah, Sigil. It's been quite controversial, hasn't it? Some people have loved it. Some people, not so much, because they say it's too hard. As a result, I'm going to be doing this playthrough on... Oh, hi. Nightmare. I'm going to be doing this playthrough on Hurt Me Plenty. It's my first time. It's like 80% blind. I've seen the first level and tiny bits of various other levels. <clears throat> yeah. But I've heard that Hurt Me Plenty is kind of a more fair and balanced experience, but I'm probably going to... Or I'm planning to do Ultra Violence on live stream, which probably will have been done by the time you're seeing this. So if you want to see that, go check out the other channel, Piece of Pie Live. Oh, no. So without further ado, let's go, D. Wow. Yeah, I've seen all of this level. I know where all the secrets are. Other than that, I've remained bog off as blind as possible. Yeah. I think a lot of the complaints with this seem to be like that it's too hard. But a lot of those complaints seem to be from people who chose ultra violence, so what do you expect? I've also heard people complain that that you have to shoot things and you normally wouldn't think to do that in Doom, like it's not something that is a common thing. It bloody teaches you to do it in the first room. I think it was specifically uh, that G-Man Lives complained about that. I'm not 100% sure, so don't take my word for that, but anyway, let's get on with it. Seeing this secret cheese. Actually, I don't want to go over here yet. It's good music, this is. No offence to the Buckethead likers, but from what I've heard it just isn't quite isn't quite my kind of thing. Sounds good enough for what it is, but... Whoop. Hi, it's Wonk. It's a Wobhead. Is it? I guess so. There. I will admit some of these are a bit dodgily hidden, I suppose. It is also a bit dark over here. That's another complaint I've heard. Some levels are a bit dark. There's quite a few complaints I've heard. Narrow spaces to fight on. Um the darkness. Unfair stuff, but we'll see. I'm trying to go in to prove people wrong, because I'm the best player at this game, not really, no. And, uh, yum. Oh, Paul, you've obviously played... No, I told you, I've seen this level. Oh, yes. Yeah, Sig 8 Ig. Sig a Zig Ah, if you want to be my lover, you got to be a demon. That is, you've got to be a demon, not beat a demon. Where am I? Oh, this level's rubbish. What a stupid game. No, not really. Not yet, anyway. Alright. Oh, Let's go over to the other side, shall we? Yum. Good, the last secret I get is the map, when I don't need it anymore. God. I have also looked up where the secret exit is. I don't... well, I know what level it's in. But I don't know how to get there. So we'll just have to look for it, won't we? Yum. It was a bit dodgy up here on ultraviolence. I believe there's two shotgunners, a pinky and a cacodemon. And the cacodemon is right here. 
so yeah, it's not particularly fair, but anyway. Now we're heading into blindness. Sheol from the Binding of Isaac. Ah, how did that go over here already? Oh, hello. We're still doing this, are we? Oh, hi. Get out. Oh. Oh, is that what that did? Oh, boy, you've obviously played this before. You specifically looked over there immediately. No, I was looking for some bloody imps. Ah! Music, yo, music. Isn't it glorious? Always check the door behind you. Ow! Immediate pain, hello? Kind of made me jump. Hi, hey guys. Oh, what have we got over here? Fuck all! Ow! Ow! Penis off. This is too hard. What a load of junk. No, not quite yet. Hello? Look at all this health that you give me. I don't want that. Look at all this ammo you give me as well. Oh! The wall is built in such a way that going on over there now? In such a way that it's a bit difficult to back into. Oh. This is a little bit I've seen. I've seen that Baron. I don't know how I want to deal with him though, because I've got fuck all ammo. So I guess I'll go in here first. Avoid the ammo. What's that? What has this done? Do you know what I mean? Hello? Shall I go down there? I don't think so. There's no point. What a silly place to exist. What the hell? Why did I get an auto save there? What a bunch of losers. Red key? Oh. Oi! I was just trying to get back onto the platform, but thanks, I guess. God, come on. Hi. Ow. That was kind of my face. For fuck's sake. Oh, what? Oh, right. It saved it on the autosave instead of on Sigil because it made the autosave and defaulted me to that. What a plonk. Whoa. Oh. But yeah, another complaint I've heard is that there's a lot of big enemies and you kind of have to take forever fighting them with the shotgun. I don't want to fight the Baron. You don't have to kill everything. Some might argue that's undoom like of you to leave a demon alive, but I'm not doom guy, am I? I'm just some twat in his shoes. I want a backpack so I can have that box of shotgun ammo. Hello? Evil maze. Whatever. Is that our first Kako demon? It is. At least they didn't take too many. Ow! It's a bit cramped in here. You see, this is the trouble with hearing a bunch of stuff about it. I'm going in with bias. Or expectations or whatever. Oh, hello. Oi! Where am I now? I'm over here. Oh. Fart. Whoop. 
I don't know why that happens. Where is that? Uh, okay, I can stand on this. It's not a secret, I saw it from over there. God, where am I? I don't know. What did I get? I got a soul sphere. Didn't I just do that? Music! Where's the exit gonna be? Hi guy, I'm back. I'm going again now. I've been everywhere. Kind of. I'm a little bit confused here. Do you want me to jump into Lava Village? Probably not. Crack. Ramiro and his cracks in reality. I don't bloody know. There must be a reason I opened this up, right? I guess not. What the hell, man? Where does one go at such a time in life? That, that way to get back to the star. Don't remember. Oh! Feels like over here somewhere. Uh, yeah, over here. Oh, where is it? How many secrets we got? Most of them. Doesn't do anything. I don't understand. What a good. What a good. There's gotta be a reason the wall came down. I can't see shit in here. That's not a teleport. Hello? What? Okay. Bye. Wait, what was that? Cages of the damned. Oh, damn, son. I ain't got any bullets. There were like no bullet pickups in that level. Music. Hi. Shall I get rid of you? I'm certainly starting to see what people mean with everything being cramped. Oh! He's crushy. I guess not. It's no longer cramped and I finally got some bullets. Yum. Finally got loads of bullets, so oh. don't forget about that little thing that you can do, otherwise you might be in hot water. What? I guess I'll have it. Um, I wouldn't mind having some night vision goggles as well. Some permanent ones for the whole game. Bloody hell, man. They weren't kidding. I'm only on level 3. Where's that zombie dude over here? Is that done? Oh, that's opened up the world, that has. I better get another suit, because I have to come back here someday. Look at it out here. Find some cover. Deal with the cack. Who was that? I killed everyone up there already. What a wallop. 
don't know what that lost soul's problem is. He can't do shit. Oh. This music is a bit quiet. My ongoing problem. <clears throat> Die so I can talk. My ongoing problem with playing custom Doom stuff. Such audio balancing. Some is too loud. Some isn't. Oh, I didn't really want that yet, but oh well. I'll take it. I'll save that bullet. For just when I need it. To get a single headshot on a cyber demon. It was recently discovered by me, I'll have you know, that you can actually kill the cyber demon in one pistol shot if you hit just the right pixel. Most people don't know that. You can't actually, don't worry. That would be silly. That would be very silly indeed. Right, I've got the red key. I kind of want to go leaping. Can I jump? No, good. You wouldn't be able to anyway, because it's made in Doom 1 style. And you can't jump in Doom 2 either, so I don't know why that would matter, but you know. Hello? Who was that? Nice one, losers. You pissed off a Baron. Worst idea you ever had. Ow! Wait, where am I? The world has opened up over here. Yes, fight. This is wonderful. Bye. Good. Good, I do get another suit. And another caca demon. What a load of caca. Don't know where you think you're going. Look at this cramped space. Oh. Bloody hell, more is opening. I'm out of here. Bye. Am I? I don't know. Depends what's behind here. Fuck all. I wonder who won the battle between the Kaka Demon and the Baron. Hmm. Who would? This reminds me of Circle of Destruction. Or whatever. Hello? Hello? Oh, okay. And that upside down cross reminded me of E2M1 because who wouldn't be reminded of that? Are we playing the Linear Doom mod now? I guess so. It's not a secret, it was open. Oh yes please. Now where am I? Why am I out here? I don't know, dude. I think I'll save these rockets if you don't mind, if you can fit through here anyway, or I could just leg it. Bye. Paths of the wretchedness without the. Ah oh, yes. Oh, who could hate this? Oh. But yeah. Overall, this is pretty good, I guess. Just a bit too dark, and obviously the cramped spaces to fight on, as everybody complains about. Other than that, the difficulty's fine. But I expected that because I chose Hurt Me Plenty. Let me have a look over here first. Oh! oh. Choose your adventure! Which path would you like to take? Whichever one is less painful, I think you'll find. I don't know where to put this playthrough. Since it's kind of like a proper game release. What the? What's going on? What? I feel like it might deserve to be in its own playlist, but it's kind of also just a Doom map pack. 
you know, just because it's by Romero doesn't doesn't necessarily make it any different from any other Doom map pack or Mega Wad, whatever you want to call it. Since it's free as well. I was wondering about that, like, can he get away with selling this? Sure, he was one of the original people that worked on Doom, but Bethesda owns Doom now. But I guess the version that you buy was mostly for the soundtrack or something by the KFC head man. Alright, what's over here then? I don't know. Not a lot by the look of it. Let's have a dip. No, let's not. That darker spot. It is, but it ain't anything. Ain't no thang. What happened? What? What's the point? I guess that's how you get back up if you fall down. That stands out for no reason. Should we turn the music up? Oh, hello. Just a tad. <laughs> 